Do you spend four to five dollars a day on gourmet specialty drinks? Well, I'm gonna show you how to make your very own at home, no special equipment needed. Hey guys, I'm Shireen. Welcome to my kitchen. If you like homemade recipes made from scratch, but easy enough for everyday cooking, go ahead and subscribe below. Turn on that notification bell so you don't miss a recipe. Today we're making a peppermint latte. So kind of think of it like a cheater peppermint latte. You don't need a cappuccino maker. You don't need a frother. We're going to froth the milk. I'm going to show you how. Let's do it. So you first want to start with espresso coffee beans. So we want to mimic the flavor of an espresso and freshly ground, of course. We're using a regular coffee maker, but we're making the coffee extra strong. Homemade whipped cream, three ingredients, heavy cream, confectionery sugar, and pure vanilla extract. So when you're making your homemade whipped cream, you want it to be on medium speed and periodically you want to brush down the sides with a rubber spatula and go slowly because you can over whisk that cream really quickly and we want it to be smooth and silky. So it's been two minutes. Perfect. Come look at this. This is perfectly velvety creamy whipped cream. Now it's time to sweeten up our latte. As we get it ready, we're adding sugar and our chopped candy cane. Sorry, I scared you earlier. But that peppermint is gonna give the latte beautiful flavor. No need to buy the peppermint syrup. So if you don't have a frother, you can just place your warm milk into a stand mixer or a hand mixer and then beat it on high. It'll pump in the air, giving you that frothy texture. Okay, remember, we're cheating here. We don't really have the froth, but wait for it. There it is. Ah, there's our froth. You certainly can buy a frother, but we're cheating. And our beautiful, creamy, sweetened whipped cream. Nothing better. And of course, that remaining candy cane bits right on top for that crunchy sweetness with the creamy whipped cream as you sip along and a little chocolate. And there you have it, a peppermint latte that you can make at home. You can find the link to this recipe down in the description. And if you like this video, go ahead and give me a thumbs up, comment in the comment box below, be sure to subscribe. And if you like moist, delicious chocolate cake, make sure you click this video link right here and I'll meet you over there. Joy.